The stadium is buzzing already and with good cause. Two top sides ready to go at it and this should be something special on the pitch. Well, you only need to look at the history books to see how close this fixture historically has been. Barcelona at home against Real Madrid on this occasion. I'm Derek Ray, sitting alongside me here on the gantry is Stuart Robson. And Stuart, this ought to be special. Well, Derek, this is a magnificent setting for a great rivalry. Let's just hope we see both teams... And touched onto the frame of the goal. Barcelona free kick, it'll be here. Well, the referee decides not to reach for his pocket at this early stage. Well, I thought he might book him there, but in the end, I think he's got that right. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen starts in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. He has teammates around him. Happy to shoot. Great defending. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Verlon Mendy plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Federico Valverde plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Oh, body in the way, crucially! You can't really discuss impact players without discussing Robert Lewandowski. Well, Derek, whether he's on the run, driven a shot, hitting a volley, or even shooting with the inside of his foot, he strikes the ball with such power. And this is why he beats the goalkeeper so often. He's a tremendous striker of the ball. Carvajal. Space here for Barcelona. And making the move to the inside. Keeper getting the touch. And eventually, goalkeeper's ball. Well, you can sense the relief amongst his teammates, but what a first save that was. Good work from Barcelona to win it back. Now Lewandowski carries the ball forward, but can he produce from this position? Mendy. Mbappe. Bellingham. Return to Mbappe. It's been aimed towards the front first. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. On the ball, Felipe. And he has options available. And Bellingham. On to Carvajal. Tremendously strong in the tackle. The first half here comes to an end. Well, let's get your assessment, Stuart, on Robert Lewandowski. Has he given enough? Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In my view, he's got to make more runs behind this back line in the second half. So back underway here into the second half. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Now, can they hit them on the counter? That's a lovely ball. And the keeper more than equal to it. Lewandowski. Danny Olmo. 
And he read it well. Carvajal. Felipe. Bellingham. Vinicius Jr. And defensive play to be applauded. Danny Olmo. Williams. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Well, there you have it. Barcelona's creativity has been really good, but their finishing just hasn't matched it. But I do sense they will eventually make their superiority count. Well, now on the ball, can they add a bit of danger to the mix? It was on its way in. Lewandowski. Oh, big opportunity. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. 15 minutes left for play. Barca know it's a sector of the pitch devoid of defenders, but the danger averted for now. Counter-attacking chance. Mbappe. Can he put them in front? He does! And with so little time left, that might be the winner. Wonderful drama. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Well, it hasn't been a great performance. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. Just couldn't get it through. Well, this late corner could represent their last chance to equalise. Who's going to get on the end of it? And clearing his lines. And whipped into the box. Oh, going for the bicycle kick special, and he didn't miss by much. Well, what a goal that would have been. That was a brilliant bit of skill. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Well, good run and good ball control. And so the referee's whistle for full time. Barcelona have lost. I wonder what you made of this. Yes, Derek, it was a tight game between two very good sides, but they lost concentration late on and it's cost them dearly. They'll need to get over that quickly. Well, just the sort of performance they were looking for from the talented Kylian Mbappe. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him.